Look out, watch, just wait and see If you like fishing then come with me, yeah Forget about the weather, let it rain on me If you like fishing then come with me, yeah On a river, the bay, the lake, the sea If you like fishing then come with me, yeah I said if you like fishing then come with me If you like fishing then come with me If you like fishing then come with me I'll just sneak here and get a net for you, mate. Thanks, Nigel. I'll tell you what, it's not too bad, this fella. Yeah. We're too busy watching the weather and a rod was buckling <laughs> over in the background. <laughs> oh, jeez. Mad dogs, Englishmen, a couple of Aussie fishermen. <laughs> Go down the midday westerlies. Yeah, he's a nice, nice sunshine reef. That's an average <laughs> snapper for this area. He's probably just on that squire snapper size, but he's a nice little fish to start the day. He's a great little fish. I'll tell you what, in 30 odd metres of water or a fraction under 30, I tell you what, the swells vary in that much are at 31, then 30, then 29, <laughs> back to 31. Gotta let this little fella go, mate. Just bear with me, Australia. You should go straight away. The dead bait is going off. This is a good fish too. And uh, we'll just say, um, the reason why we are dead baiting with this new penny grub is pretty simple. You can see how rough it is, and it's keeping the bait up and down. Moving it up and down with the current and of course with the swell. And it's been two for two now on this dead bait. Oh, another nice fish. Hey, that's all right. Another nice fish, Nige. You know what, mate? Beautiful. Oh, well done, mate. Good stuff. Great work. And there's another fish about two kilos, and it's great fun on this gear. I think it's a rim. Oh my God, Nige. Oh yeah. Oh, He's a big one too. My. <laughs> God, Nigel! That's all you wanted? Oh, I've seen it all. I have seen it all on this show, and I'm gonna tell you the truth. Behind camera, we're fishing at the wharf. You saw that about 30 seconds ago. Nigel said, before we pack up JK, I wanna go hit the boat. We traveled around, and that is the result. Look at that. What a magnificent fish. And that is one of the biggest brim I've ever seen in my life, Nigel. He's not a bad one in Queensland. They're supposed to be big down south. We, we get the odd big one up here, well, and and four pound leader. Just shows you what you can do if you if you don't panic them around structure too much. You get them out in the open, and you just use that rod tip. You know, four pound leader. A lot of people wouldn't consider chasing brim like that on four pound leader, but uh, transition four pound leader, and uh, that's a good kilo brim. Well, I tell you what, now we're going back to the boat round to wrap it up because nothing's going to beat this this morning. <laughs> you are uh, <laughs> ate the wonder of the world.